Hi guys, it's Molly. Today I thought I would do my highlights of 2016 because I saw a video, I think it was Louise Pentland, that inspired me to do this video because it looked really cool and hmm, I've just realised I've lost my voice and this probably is the worst time to be filming a video. So I am sorry in advance. Also, I don't know if you can see what the background says. It says, do what makes you happy and I stand by that. Everyone seems to think 2016 was the worst year in history of man, <laughs> basically. I think personally 2016 was one of my best years. I really enjoyed my 2016, I had a really lovely time and I've got a whole list here of what I did in 2016. So, so I've kind of struggled to find some things in some months. So in January I put down that I had physio and the reason I put this down is because it kind of we worked out what was wrong with my back which is kind of a big deal for me because obviously I've had so much pain so now that we know why I got the pain it's great because I can I can like try and work around that and try and make it better and I know that it's something that I can work on so yeah that was good I'm just gonna shine a light on my face because the lighting's crap so in February I had my sister-in-law's Hindu, which was really fun because we had a spa day and we had afternoon tea which was great and I've never had anything like that before so it was kind of nice and new and fun and yeah that was February and then everything kind of started to set off in March and March I did my piano exam and I found out my results the same month and I got a distinction in my first ever piano exam which was great which was a grade 2 I also got my bronze DAV award which was great because I did so much work to get that and I got it and it was the most rewarding thing ever. And also lastly the best thing to happen was I danced at the Royal Albert Hall which was amazing. It was probably one of the best things ever. I absolutely loved it, had a great time and I'm so happy to have danced there again for the second time. It was just a lovely thing to achieve. I'm trying to balance the light on the tripod. Way. Why didn't I think of this before? And then April I was a bridesmaid at my brother's wedding which was perfect. I did a video on it, I can link it down below or I can put it on the screen if I work out how to. But it was one of the best nights ever. I absolutely loved it, it was beautiful and I had a lovely time. And in May was my 16th birthday, I went to go ape with a couple of my friends. And I also, this is very cool because I left school which obviously is a very big thing in everybody's lives because school you don't know anything different until you get to my age so the day we left school we went to the park all of us had loads of photos we hung around till about five it was lots of fun and i really enjoyed myself in june i finished my exams which was one of the best feelings ever i, I think i did how many did i do i did 19 exams in total so finishing that was the best thing in the world and i also had prom I also did a vlog on proms, I can link it on the screen now if I worked out how to or in the description if you want to see that. And then in July not much happened because it was just a month of relaxation after exams. So I did a lot of stretching, I think that this is the month where I got my splits. I got my full splits on both legs which was amazing because that was my new year's resolution and I managed to get it which was brilliant. did a drama show, in August I went on holiday to Menorca which I also did a vlog on, I will put it on the screen or in the description if I can't do the screen thing, you know how it works by now. And I had a really nice time, we went for two weeks and as I said, did a vlog, all on there, did the whole thing. And I also got my results in August, which I got one A, five Bs, three Cs and one D in music, but I don't care. In September I started college, which obviously isn't exciting and it's not a highlight, but it's something big in my life you know starting school starting college starting work it's anything big so started college and I think I oh no I didn't like it at the start I'm not really liking it I don't really like it now but I started college got my haircut which is something big for me so in November I did my dance show which we do yearly and I absolutely love dance shows because obviously I love dance and I got the main modern award of the year which is amazing so this is the modern award i got it's blooming massive it's got the modern award on it and it's got people's names from all the years and yeah i was just so happy to get it because i've worked so hard in modern this year and i just 
I'm very happy. And then I also got a job in November, which is half the reason I'm so rubbish at uploading. So I got a job in November. My first day working was November 24th, and I am still working to this day. And yeah, got a job. It was just something, because I've never had a job before, so actually getting paid was one of the best feelings in the world. And then in December, I went to Centre Parks for a holiday, and I would say I have a vlog to link, but I don't because it hasn't been uploaded yet. Look out for that, hopefully soon it will be uploaded. So that was everything that I managed to achieve this year. I've not actually lost many friends this year. I've gained quite a few new friends. I feel 100% more happier with myself and my life. And I don't know, I just feel like 2016 was the year that I needed. Even though, yes, globally probably wasn't the best year, but I really enjoy myself personally, so thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did. And I'm very sorry for my croaky voice this whole time. It's probably really annoyed you. Comment down below if you enjoyed your 2016 or if you didn't. Why, why not? And don't forget to click that subscribe button to see new videos every the day that I decide to upload <laughs> and I will see you all next week with another new video. Bye, love you lots!